Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. This is Paula Zen and today we're doing a reading for the 22nd to the 28th of March. For those of you returning into my channel, welcome back. For those of you that you are brand new to my channel, you're very welcome to this beautiful channel. In this channel, we tend to pass messages focused on healing, love, compassion, and motivating you on your journey. Okay. So today we're starting, first of all, with the energy from the Wisdom of the Tarot, where they want to just jump out, okay? And then we will read the Tarot for you as well. Okay, and we'll get one more card. We're taking three cards from the Wisdom of the Tarot, and then we're going to go into the Tarot. The Wisdom of the Oracle, I don't know why I keep saying it. All my readings, you will hear Wisdom of the Tarot. Um, so we start here first of all the first card with the limit okay we need just one card and iris i think it was iris that had the same card here so it does feel like for some of you it's like the end of something you just reach the end of something you're just ready to go you know you're ready to um you've done everything you could there's there's nothing else you could be doing right now so you might just pick your things and go you know because you don't want to be living according to the past you don't want to be living according to the future you want to be living to what you have now and probably some one some people some work around you they just live on the everything around with the exception of the now okay because we also have here the card here and now okay so living in the present moment so the the cards are literally asking you to live in the present moment to let go what doesn't serve you anymore to let go anything any ideas any feelings any thoughts that they just don't serve you and okay you, th there's no need to be fighting against this these thoughts, these people, this career, whatever is happening, this energy there, whatever is happening around you, okay? And we also have the card fix. So this is the time to fix something. It's the time to let go of something and to fix what you actually want to do right now. And this is why we also have here, here and now. It's very important that you focus on the present moment and you figure out what you actually want for your life, for you, for your energy, what do you want okay not what other people what you want and this is why these cards are are very much suggesting here that you look inside you okay you open the door of your heart to what it is now to what you want to what you need to fix okay there are probably some things that you need to fix um in your life maybe some um I'm having a lot of emotions that need to be healed. Okay, when it fix doesn't have to be fixed, but need to be healed. Maybe there is something because if we look here, the line is blue. So this blue relates with um, throat chakra. So your communication, your creativity, speaking your own truth, being yourself. Okay, so it's it's like there's the need to be yourself. It's it's enough of trying to please everything and everyone just because you don't want anything coming to you. Okay. But let's see what the tarot has to say as well in relation to this. Let's see. Let's see. There's something here that maybe the number three and the number two could have something some importance in your life maybe the number maybe on the 23rd because we have the 32 opposite so i'm feeling this one um but for you it, it, it's funny because i'm looking at the cards of course right and and this here and now are telling me that for you to have peace inside you you need to be on the here and now Okay, I feel that was an important message for some people here. So we have the Justice, the Magician, and Devil. Okay, let's clarify these cards now. So we have Page of Swords. Okay, 
I'm very chatty my cards tonight tonight for me tomorrow for you could be the morning or afternoon for you wherever you are watching this video so we start here with this justice and this page of swords so again this limit um card with this justice and page of swords energetically what i feel here is that there is something about a contract i don't mean a contract of course you have to remember that a contract is not just about a job okay a relationship can be a contract a friendship can be a contract a partnership can be a contract um you go into the supermarket you're making a contract that once you pick up your things you're gonna pay so there's already a contract there as well okay so everything in our life it's about contracts give and take contracts energies contracts okay everything is a contract so this justice with the page of swords it's like there's something i'm feeling there's something needs to to be over okay something that needs to finish some sort of contract that you you, you just cannot take it anymore you know you just want it to finish this could be as well in relation to some um legal issues okay attorneys um any court case, any suitcase, anything like that, that you, you had enough, okay, you just want to, just wanted it to finish. And it's like someone new is going to come up and just show you the way to it, okay. This page of swords is literally talking about again for me about a new idea. So maybe there's a new way to do things, okay? Maybe there will be a new way of resolving some issue. And then we have the eight of cups with the magician, and we have the three of wands with the devil. Okay. So magician and eight of cups under the here and now. What do you have to do right here and right now? You need to focus on what do you want? How do you want to live? How do you want to follow with your life? What do you want to manifest in your life? What is your why? What do you really want for you? Okay, is it material thing? Is it working on what you want, what fills your heart? Or what pleases other people is what excites you or what excites other people you know all these questions that you need to answer because this magician here it's like he manipulates all the elements to do exactly what he wants and and this is this is completely you okay Sagittarius this is you you have the knowledge and you have the power to do this, okay? You have the knowledge and the power to go what after you want to do. No one else, only you. And what he feels here is that everything around you doesn't serve you. You know, it serves other people. It's great for other people. It fills their cups, but it doesn't fill yours. All right, and under the fixed card, we have the devil and the three of wands. This devil here, I don't see anything wrong with this card. The only thing I see here is stop living other people's lives, okay? And start living your, uh, your own life with this three of wands. Start visualizing what you want, not what someone else's want. Because you could be having very much a lot of people telling you, you should do this. Sagittarius, you should do that. Sagittarius, you should turn this road. Sagittarius, you should turn that road. No, it's your life. It's what you want to do, okay? It's it's what you want to achieve. Three of Wands, okay? What, 
what you visualize, what you actually want to achieve. Because whatever you manifest, you will get that. But the question here is, are you manifesting what you want or are you manifesting what someone else wants you to have? It's time for you to claim your power. Okay? I want to get here from my familiar tarot a final card as a final advice here, okay? I'm just going to take one card. Whatever comes, it's very welcome here. Whatever comes, it's welcome. Um, Sagittarius, I would invite you as well to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done yet, if you're resonating with this with this reading, if the message is appropriate, and even to share this video if there's someone that you believe would resonate um, with this reading or just need to receive a message on this video, okay? And I do appreciate all the support, all the likes, all the subscriptions. So let's see what is your final card. Two of Cups, okay? Choose love, choose you, choose your cup, okay? Choose who meets your cup, okay? Not who else would like it to, but who fills your cup. This is your time. It's the time for you to make a decision, okay? It's the time for you to decide to be happy, to be loved, to be in partnerships, to, to have a partner, whatever you wish, okay? Because look at all the stars around here. It's like dreaming. It's like what you want, okay? What you've been dreaming through all your life, okay? So this is what I have for you. I hope you enjoy your reading. And until next time, have a great week. Bye.